Well, hello everyone. Today I am gonna show you how you can install my customized Hyperland setup in your Arch Linux. As you can see, I'm in freshly installed Arch Linux and also I have installed Hyperland already. Let me just remove the message at the top. So, now go to your web browser and visit to this GitHub repository. I will provide the link in the description. Scroll a little bit down to the installation section, you will find a link to directly install. Just copy it and paste into your terminal. And it will start the installation script. First it will install some necessary packages. So feel free to provide your password and continue. After that, it will clone the main repository and run the script. Just wait for it. It will automatically detect your distribution and prepare the scripts for it. Well, first it will ask you to choose from the options you want to install. Just select them using your space bar, you can choose multiple options if you need. Now, if you haven't installed any AUR helper, just select one of them. For now, I'll go with Yay, but to be honest, I love Paru. After installing the AUR helper, it will start the main scripts to install the packages. Just wait till it finish. In this part, it will ask you to install a browser. Just press enter which one you want to install. Well, after recording this video, I added a skip option. From now, you can skip if you don't want to install any browser. Now it will clone the .files repository to set it up into your system. Just wait till it copies. Now it will ask if you want to add more wallpapers. For now, I am gonna skip it. After finishing the script successfully, it will ask you to reboot. Just reboot your system and log in back. After login, you will see a nice Arch Linux wallpaper and a gorgeous looking waybar. A pop up will appear to set your monitor refresh rate. It will detect your monitor resolution automatically. Just select the refresh rate for better experience. All right. But unfortunately, it didn't change the cursor theme. Just open the NWG look and set the cursor theme. After login back, it should change the cursor. And now, just explore things.
To see all the key bindings, just press the Super Shift and H key. Now, if you want to change the basic things easily without opening the files, just press Super and S key. From here you can change things very easily, like the border size, roundness, and so on. So, that's all for now. Just install it and explore the things. And feel free to suggest me what more can I do in this config. Thank you.